the hatchet girl. Why are there so few people in the court of a perfect saint? Because every time they enter, the hatchet girl asks for a piece of their ego, and she doesn't give it back. Ouch. For years, my heart inquired of me. For years, my heart inquired of me what Jasmine's sacred cup might be, and what was in its possession. It asked from strangers constantly, begging the pearls that slipped its shell from lost cells wandering by the sea. Last night, I took my troubles to the mega sage. Whose keen eyes see a hundred answers in the wine, whose cup he, laughing, showed to me. I questioned him, "What was this cup that shows the world's reality?" Handed to you, he said, "The day heaven's vault of lapis lazuli was raised, and marvelous things took place by intellect's divine decree, and Moses' miracles were made." And samurai's apostasy. He added, "Then that friend, they hanged high on the looming gallows tree." His sin was that he spoke of things which, should he have pondered secretly, the page of truth his heart enclosed was anointed publicly. And if the Holy Ghost once more should lend his age to us, we'll see others perform what Jesus did. Since in his heartsick anguish, he was unaware that God was there, and called his name out ceaselessly. I asked him next, and beauty's curls that trembled down so sensuously, what is their meaning? Whence do they come? Hafez, the, the sage replied to me, it's your distracted, love-loom heart. That asks these questions constantly. Leave the familiar for a while. Let your senses and bodies stretch out, like a welcome season unto the meadow and shores and hills. Open up to the road. Make a new watermark on your excitement and love, like a blooming night flower. Bestow your vital fragrance of happiness at giving. Upon our intimate assembly, change rooms in your mind for a day. All the hemispheres in existence lie besides an equator in your heart. Greet yourself in your thousand other forms as you mount the hidden tide and travel back home. All the hemispheres in heaven are sitting around the fire, chatting. While stitching themselves together into the great circle inside of you.
Like the morning breeze. Like the morning breeze, if you bring to the morning good deeds, the rose of our desire will open and bloom. Go forward and make advances down this road of love. In forward motion, the pain is great. To bake at the door of the wine house is a wonderful alchemy. If you practice this soon, you will be converting dust into gold. O、oh、heart, if only once you experience the light of purity, like a laughing candle, you can abandon the life you lived in your head. But if you're still yearning for cheap wine and a beautiful face, don't go out looking for an enlightened job. Afiz, if you listen to this good advice, the road of love and its enrichments are right around. The curve. Let thought become your beautiful lover. Let thought become the beautiful woman. Cultivate your mind and heart to that depth. Then it can give you everything a warm body can. Why just make in love with God's child for when a friend himself is standing before us, so open up, my dear. Let prayer become your beautiful lover, and become free. Become free of this whole world, like a vase. I have learned so much from God that I can no longer call myself a Christian, a Hindu, a Muslim, a Buddhist, a Jew. The truth has shared so much of itself with me that I can no longer call myself a man, a woman, an angel, or even a pure soul. Love has befriended Havens so completely. He has turned to ash, and freed me of every concept and image my mind has ever known.
school of truth. Oh fool, do something so you won't just stand there looking dumb. If you're not traveling and on the road, how can you call yourself a guide? In the school of truth, one sits at the feet of the master of love. So listen, son, so that one day you may be an old father too. All this eating and sleeping has made you ignorant and fat. And fat, by denying yourself food and sleep, you might still have a chance. Know this: if God should shine His love light on your heart, I promise you shall shine brighter than a dozen suns. And I say, wash the tarnished copper of your life from your hands. To be love's alchemist, <coughs> you should be working with gold. Don't stare. Th- Don't sit there thinking. Go out and immerse yourself in God's seas. Having one wet hair with water will not put knowledge in that head. For those who see only God, their vision is pure, and not a doubt remains. Even if our world is turned upside down and blown over by the wind, if you are doubtless, you won't lose a thing. O、oh, Havaz, if it is union with the beloved that you seek, be the dust at the wise one's door, and speak. I said it before. And I'll say it again. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. It's not my fault that with a broken heart I've gone this way. In front of a mirror, they have put me like parrot, and behind the mirror, the teacher tells me what to say. Whether I am perceived as a thorn or a rose, it's the gardener who has fed and nourished me day to day. Oh, friends. Don't blame me for this broken heart. Inside me there is a great jewel, and it's to the jeweler's shop I go. Even though to pious drinking wine is a sin, don't judge me. I use it as a bleach to wash the color of hypocrisies away. All that laughing and weeping of lovers must be coming from some other places. Here, all night I sing. With my wine cup, and then moan for you all day. If someone were to ask Hafaz, why do you spend all your time sitting in the wine house door? To this man, I would say, from the standing, I can see both the path and the way. We may have to medicate you. Resist your temptation to lie. 
by speaking a separation from God. Otherwise, we might have to medicate you. In the ocean, a lot goes on beneath your eyes. Listen, they have clinics there too, for the insane, who persists in saying things like, I am independent from the sea. God is not around, gently pressing against my body. No more learning. At some point, your relationship with God will become like this. Next time you meet him in the forest or on a crowded city street, there won't be any more leaving, that is. God will climb into your pocket. You will simply just take yourself. <laughs>